What's up guys? We're doing three installs in one day. We are finishing his headliner. Y'all can see it in the background. We're almost done recording that video. And then my boy, Andrew, he don't have a button back here. Sheesh, that sucks. You got one on the ground. <laughs> he got coilovers and y'all can peep his new tail lights. I know, I don't think we made a video of this, but Lamont, got tail lights also he got led tag lights and a third third brake light because <laughs> the other one was a piece of crap but what we're installing on the malibu right now is the bnr throttle body spacer so i'm gonna just say definitely high quality these are for like any i believe it said nas if i had it and or um what's it called anything to increase the performance even more you know like to any lines or whatnot so unfortunately we don't have that um so there's bnr the boys over there that only make performance parts for chevys pretty much um i got an intercooler coming i got a story for that and the next video should be here next week uh, and then <laughs> yeah so what are these did you see what these were what is that the bolts we gotta take off. No, it's, it's like a, a seven. There's eight. a clip here. Well, I know, right. but we gotta take that off. Pry that out, pull this off, and then that should be 10 millimeter. 10 millimeter. It's one, two, three, and four. Yeah, there's four mm -hmm. 10 millimeter bolts. Uh, with the disconnect BNR, the battery because it's electrical. Yeah, you gotta disconnect the battery, and then we'll be able to take that stuff off. They implemented these. Um, so that'll uh, come in clutch and yeah we're gonna put oh these right here are for the holes at the bottom so if i did have it i wouldn't need these but these are just to close the gap so you know it doesn't have a leakage issue but yeah we're gonna be having more parts from bnr coming soon and um i'm excited so let's go ahead and get started all right so once you do it uh disconnect your negative terminal all you do is pop that up and it'll come right off technical difficulties mm -hmm. <laughs> all right we finished like, how many roaches do it take to screw on a light bulb oh my god 21 20 21 at 21 you drinking you drinking legally oh my god okay guys i'll back when uh, we got that all right so we put those in there 16th island ranch they are i have no more snacks dude i'm all out and then y'all can see that we got it disconnected. So, all right. So, um, the throttle body spacer is on. All we got to do is screw these in. Uh, all they provide the hardware, and literally, that's all we need. And yeah, all we got to do is tighten it down. Lord have mercy. But um. BNR, Bad News Racing. That's uh, they're in Florida, so they're pretty lit. They make they're the only people that make stuff for my car specifically. One, so two, see y'all in a second when this is on. All right, so <laughs> got that nice fresh <laughs> BNR right there. Oh, now literally all we gotta do is put this back on. Ow, finger. Oh man, we're back. Negative battery cable. So we'll see. If it adds anything, they say it does, so I don't, I don't doubt it. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll be back in a little bit. this video is rocky i should have had my gopro right now but it's the same day just darker um just wanted to 
to give you guys a little update on the car with the BNR tune, or not tune, but uh, the throttle spacer. Okay, so I had a boost leak, I'll throw that clip in. It would probably be the clip before this, but long story short, these headlights suck. Um, but anyway, the throttle body spacer definitely helped with the response and the boost build up because my car feels faster. It definitely wants to pull more. Uh, I get more pop, <clears throat> excuse me, I get way more pops. Let me roll up these windows. I get way more pops. Uh, the turbo feels more responsive so far. No check engine light, so for everyone that don't have a tune, it's definitely a mod for you. Um, I'll be getting the tune soon, but I wanna get a couple more of their products first on the car that don't require a tune and then get it tuned with everything. That way it'll be, you know, one swing. Um, I'm gonna get, they have a turbo upgrade that I wanna get, but I'm gonna probably invest in that probably sometime next year. Um, but the, they have a recirculation valve, uh, the oil cap's on the way, but that's irrelevant. And then um, they got a couple things. They got a couple of spicy things for the Malibu. Um, I wish there was more because I my boy got the cruise and they got a lot of stuff for the Chevy cruise the uh, generation that Dylan has but um yeah we had a interesting day so I'm gonna cut the video here because I'm pretty much going home but when I say these headlights suck guys these headlights suck like I'll probably use this clip for another video dealing with the before and after LED stock headlights versus the aftermarket ones. But like this is, <laughs> y'all couldn't even tell the difference, but this is high beams on. So, I don't know. I wish there was, they have adjustment, but I adjusted them completely max and it did nothing. So, I'm rambling. You guys have a good day and can't wait to see what y'all think about the throttle body spacer i think it's worth it don't look at my gas saying we're going through a problem but yeah no nah, like even with the cold weather right now the car feels way 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 faster than what it was um yeah so your boys decided since he's going to keep this car he might as well make it what power he can make. I'm not a big performance fan when it comes to like daily drivers and you know, gas, but I'm sure that the tune and everything will help me with that. Cause even before the throttle body spacer, my car has been not acting funny, but I feel like I just need to change the spark plugs and do a little tune up. Cause y'all see, I got like 133,000 miles. If the camera will focus, yeah. So, all right, guys, peace out, and just keep your heads up. Um, we had some unfortunate things happen earlier today, but all in all, it was still a good day. It's sad, but, you know, it's part of life. You got to overcome obstacles throughout your life, hence the name of, like, the brand and the crew and all the other stuff. So, it's just a, you know, reminder because stuff keeps popping up out of nowhere. So, all right, guys, see you on the next one.